Okay, uh, okay, Leo, you are up. Oh, Leo. Go, Leo. Um, I'm going to keep shuffling a little bit. Hold on while I, I got to talk a little bit. Please, Leo, watch the North Node in Leo uh, preview, okay? It's about a half hour, okay? If you've got a half hour spare, please watch it when you get a chance. It'll make this little report sound much more intelligible, okay? So, and also when you do read your reports, read for Moon and Rising as well, okay? Please understand that the Leo North Node transit is going to be felt in the house of your chart where Leo lies. Now for Leo Sun, that's going to be uh, wherever your Sun lies with Leo, okay, whichever house that might be. But let's say Leo is your first house. It's going to be right there in your face. By the way, any weird noises? We're shooting during the daytime, and this neighborhood gets very noisy. There's a lot of noise pollution here. My apologies. Just just treat it as like background, like effects, okay, to make it real. So, uh, Leo, because this is the Leo North Node, you might be feeling it in some ways more than others. The whole point about the Leo North Node transit is to wake people up so that we can evolve all together on this big bus of evolution to be more and more truly authentic to who we are. And with you, Leo, with the North Node in Leo, it's going to be like shining a light right in your face. Like, okay, dear Leo, in what ways are you not honoring yourself, not being your true, shiny, wonderful self, okay? All right? How are you sabotaging yourself and that would all be to do with the south node so the whole theme about the leo north node is to be happy to be creative to be self-expressive to take that risk to have fun and to be happy from the inside and don't wait for permission from others or from the community or your surroundings okay the south node represents like where you've come from where it's all been happening already okay and it's kind of obsolete been there, done that, there's nothing to prove, it's very comfortable, everything works, okay, or doesn't work, but that's part of the dysfunction, you just accept that, okay. With the Aquarius South Node, it's been all about the, um, the community uh, over the individual, people dissolving themselves into the community for the sake of and the health of the community at the expense of their individuality. Well, it's going to change, people. So, Leo, with you, uh, the emphasis is going to be on becoming yourself. Literally, it's that simple. Becoming more and more Leo. And the way we can do that is head more and more to Leo, discover what more and more Leo is about, which is about creative self-expression, uh, shining your light, radiating from the heart, being truly generous and loving, and caring, having fun, taking risks, being happy, being bold, being right out there. Think, you know, like think how rock stars behave, okay? That's Leo energy on steroids. I mean, you don't have to go that far unless you happen to be an up and coming rock star or pop star and you're watching this show, okay? So, but most of us are just like, <laughs> we've got regular lives, okay? But <clears throat> on the South Node, which is where you've been giving it all away, it's like it's in your seventh house of relationships. And so you might have been living for lifetimes uh, in situations where you kind of dissolve your ego into the community, into the relationships for the benefit of others, for the benefit of your significant other at the expense of yourself to the point where you don't even know what it's like to be an individuated person anymore. Like you gave it all away. I mean, it's very, very noble, but you're just taking it too far. And so it's time to turn it around, and we got a chance now over this cycle, North Node Leo, May 2017 to late 2018, to figure it out. So take advantage of this transit, okay? And it's going to happen, and both things are happening at the same time. The, the um, moving away from the South Node... And to bringing everything that you know, all the treasures that you've accumulated, everything that you know about what it's like to be dissolved in the community and be very, very aware of um, uh, 
partnerships and stuff like that in a way that's very beneficial for others. Okay, that's cool, but that's over now. It's it's all about you now, Leo. Okay, it's really all about you. You time. It's your time to take center stage, and enough 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 of that giving it all all my power away to the community. Okay, or to my other half for their benefit at my detriment. Okay, that's over. It's your turn to shine. Doesn't mean you're going to turn into a hyper egomaniac or anything like that. Or just become a narcissist, like with super ultra grooming, or uh, just ignoring yourself and becoming completely shabby, like um, a, 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 like a derelict mess. None of that. You're gonna you're gonna tune it and fine tune it just right. Okay. So it's a challenge because in order to evolve, it means you have to take risks and go into the future, which is the land of the unknown, and it's always unfolding on a moment by moment basis. So, <clears throat> treat this as a journey, okay? It's not a, actually a destination. It's just a, it's just a journey, and you're going to enjoy the ride because we're all on the same bus, and you're the Leo person on the bus. So, more than anyone, we are expecting you to shine. However, more than anyone, you might have been the one who's been giving it all away to the rest of us on the bus. Well, that's going to change. We're going to do a little mini tarot for you and see if we can get through this journey. I'm going to do it kind of like the way uh, we do on the Sunday night live shows. Let's see what happens, okay? Let's just let it unfold, all right? Uh, I did a lot of shuffling earlier, but I'm doing some last minute just to, to like sterilize the, the deck. I don't take flyers. I don't have any qualifiers. I don't have any of that fancy stuff. This is just bare bones, stripped down to the metal type tarot, okay? All right, so one last little... God, I'm dropping them everywhere. Sorry about the mess, people. But that's okay, <laughs> Leo North Node. We're gonna make messes now and again. Having fun can be very messy, all right? All right, so we're gonna cut it up. Cut it up. Okay, so we're gonna do it like this, Leo. Here's where you're coming from. You can think of that if you want as the south node, okay? It's the same for everybody, but this is for you. Uh, this is the present, the situation where things are right now, which is gonna be an evolutionary like continuum, okay? The present is always happening. And then here are the challenges in, your, in this journey. <clears throat> Um, this, let's basically, it's an evolutionary journey, and here's hopefully how we're going to handle it. Okay, it's tough for everybody, so but we're just going to have your version. Okay, now I can hear an airplane coming in, so please just just live with it. All right, it's just a freaking nuisance. So where are you coming from? Okay, a lot of passion, meaning well, and with an awful lot of stuff. Uh, of treasures that you can bring forward okay there's a lot of a lot a lot of pent-up spirit and vitality uh, for Leos that has probably been suppressed for a long time and it's almost like oh my god I didn't know I was this amazing and I have so much to tell I have so much to offer I can be that I know it I know it I know it I know I can it's, the, it's that kind of energy, like, I, I can do this, I can do this, I know I can, I know I can. I, I'm, I'm just working up the energy to do it. Any minute now, I'm going to do it. Any minute now, it's going to happen. Watch me, folks, watch me, folks. I'm almost there. It's like going on to the, like the you know, Olympics high diving board or something, and you've been rehearsing on it forever and playing around in the backyard with the little kiddie pool, but now you're going big time, and it's just like, oh, shit, I'm going to freeze. Okay, but you do have it. You've got an awful lot of treasure uh, and awareness from that South Node energy. And you're going to tell us what it's all like through individuation, okay? It's time to become you. You're going to be, it's, you're going to be on fire, so to speak. But just don't burn out, okay? Do all of this hugely inspirational um, energy that you can bring forward and share with us with the rest of the world, 
Uh, just don't explode on contact, okay? Do it in small doses. In other words, treat this huge transit here as a huge chance to like write a new screenplay for your new life, to rehearse it, and to do little tests, and then slowly, slowly, slowly do the full show. You can do it all in little chunks. You don't have to do it all at once like this, okay? This is really powerful, powerful, strong energy, Leo. And yeah, you might be busting out, wanting to self-express like never before, literally busting at the seams. But please, you've got to do this in tiny doses or um, it's just like you know, fire when you light a firework or something and the whole thing blows up in your face. You don't want to do that. Um, this should be a gradual, gradual release of energy, okay? So, in the present, how are you, how are you dealing with, like, I mean, how much awareness do you have of this right now? Okay, <laughs> well, perhaps deep down, Aquar uh, Leo, you've been expecting this and waiting for this, and you cannot wait to share. This is a tremendous amount of firepower all building up, pent up here, and it looks like it's just like, Thank freaking heaven, it's my time. Everyone's going to know, and everyone's going to find out, because they're going to find out the real me and what I'm really, really like, and we're going to freaking turn this into a party, okay? Which is <laughs> literally like being the rock star and like inviting everybody to your show, and everybody goes crazy, okay? It's really, really, really good. Now, if you can carry this energy long term and like do it in small doses, again, you don't have to have like plan one huge mega busting out party. Just do it in small doses, like tiny little doses, like, hey, everybody, I've got this new idea. I never knew that I was completely dissolved and lost in relationships in the community to the point where I had no identity anymore. Guess what? I've realized that I am me. Wow, isn't that so cool? Watch, I can do this. Look what I've learned. Look what I found out. Look what I know about the, the, the Aquarian energy of humanity and being there for everybody in a very selfless way. Watch, watch me. Let, let me show you how to do this and we're going to turn it into a party, okay? So if you can perpetuate and hold on to this beautiful energy throughout the cycle, this will serve you. This will get you along the evolutionary path where you need to go. Now, it, it can't be that easy, okay? It's um, This is a, a huge amount of energy piled up, like maybe energy of frustration, like at last, you know, it's been years since I've had a chance to feel this way, okay? But it's going to light up and it's going to happen for you, but just let's do it in doses. So what's the challenge of this evolutionary process here? Oh, <laughs> wow. Um, it's almost like making it happen. Uh, I mean, it's almost like you want it so bad. You want it so, so bad. You want this all to happen right now, okay? You want to bring this it's almost like I want, <laughs> I want so badly to me to be me right now because I've been so dissolved into the other to the point of disappearing that I want this. I want the full sense of me coming forward. I want the completion. I want the full package now, right now. And can you see how this relates to here and here? There is so much firepower built up inside of you, Leo, and yes, it does need to be expressed, okay? It really, really does. But you can't do it all at once because you will literally just like, uh, it, it, it like turn into a fireball, okay? Like, um, please do all this in baby steps, okay? Pretend you're on the bus with the rest of us and you've just come to this awakening. Actually, you know, you've known this is building up, okay? And now it's your moment to shine. Literally, tr try to do it in an incremental manner, like well-rehearsed, well-written, well-planned for however you are going to become the new you, the new expressive you where you claim your full radiant identity. And do it in chunks and... Uh, the challenge of reaching that sense of completion and fullness and wholeness can be achieved, but you can't 
do it all at once. It's going to be a long journey, and we're all on the same bus with you. And we understand, like, if you do it in baby steps, like, bite off one of these, one little chunk at a time, break it into two-month periods, okay? Let's just say one of these staves and wands it translates to a couple of months, okay? That's, you know, what's it, eight, four, maybe 12, maybe three months, okay? Every three months, let's just say every three months or so, you kind of push it up a notch. You kind of like do your uh, rehearsals, create the new script of your life, the new screenplay, uh, and do it in little chunks and little chapters, okay? And then bring them all into fruition slowly and celebrate each chapter as it comes through, okay? It's just like just like a movie or even more like an episodic TV show. If you can think of this journey as like an 18, 19 month, whatever it is, episodic TV show where every time period you get to the next chapter and guess what people, blah, 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 blah happens and then we did this and then we did this and we had that and we're going to do this, we're going to do that. It's going to be awesome. And then thank you. And then you can sit down on the bus for a while while we all digest and gossip about the show. And then a little while later, you do the next chapter, okay? So you do it in chunks. You don't try to rush to the end of the movie by swallowing the whole thing at once, okay? It's like gorging. It's like gorging on Netflix, watching a year and a half worth of episodes back to back, nonstop. That's insanity, okay? It's just stupid. You'll barf. And you'll end up hating it at the end. So don't go that way, okay? And so how are you going to deal with the, the challenge here? Because the challenge here is all this pent-up energy, this mind-boggling amount of energy, of identity and self that needs to be expressed um, without exploding. Okay, you have to... <laughs> don't think of the traditional uh, interpretation here. It's not working harder, it's working smarter. Okay, be really, 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 really smart about what you do so you don't trip yourself up because it's going to be extremely, no matter how well intended you may be and how passionately hungry you may be to start claiming your identity and having a personality, don't go too far too quickly because you can self-sabotage, okay, which is what you've already been doing, okay. Ultimate self-sabotage is completely and utterly giving yourself away to the other, although you meant well, because it was for the sake of the community and the relationship, that's fine, but that's at the expense of you. That's not cool anymore, and that's where you've been coming through. That, that programming, that South Node Aquarius programming is very, very deeply ingrained. It's not going to be sorted out and figured out, and you're not going to let go of it overnight in one sweep, okay? So do it in little tiny baby chunks. Be very, very, very smart. Uh, pay very close attention to the feedback that you get from everybody else as you go through your evolution in a step-by-step -step manner. Be happy all the way, but don't try to jump to the end. Don't, like, we're here right now, or no, we're not even in May. Please don't try to get to the late 2018 in one jump, okay? No more self-undoing. No more dissolving the self into the, into the community and the whole and the other. It, reclaim you. You be the star of your life, okay? All right, Leo, that's what I got for you. Please reinterpret at will. Watch your moon. Watch your rising, okay? And please, please, please watch the, the preview for the whole signs. It's the 13th video, I think. Or maybe it's the first one. I don't know. Go, Leo, okay? Go, Leo. You are a star, and we're counting on you. We can't wait for this episodic show to happen. One episode at a time, okay? Show us what you've got. Bye.